Hello and welcome back, you Schweinehunde! To get a Germanized gaming and alien isolation. Uh, since I last played, I got quite a few tips from you guys. Uh, what to do, what not to do. Apparently, I'm way too clumsy when it comes to uh, sneaking. Because I'm not sneaking very often at all. And apparently that's going to kill me a lot. Uh, quite often. Once the alien is here, and apologies if, I am s if I'm sniffling a bit today because I'm sick. I'm gonna play this especially for my friends Sven and Vanessa because they are anxiously waiting for the next episode, they said. So um, that's why I'm playing today, even though I'm sick. Uh, of course, for y all of you guys as well, but... Oh shit, I'm hearing something. Can't be good. So, I was told, yeah, to be crouched most of the time in the game will do me good so even now i don't even know we'll see like apparently i'm way too loud and i don't know how to oh how to hold my breath is that bad like um i know that the alien isn't here right now so that's why i'm running again because, you know, uh, I was told there's going to be a sequence before the alien is going to be here for a long oh time. God. Oh, shit, yeah. It's ugly. Yeah, shit. Okay. That sounds creepy. I hear something. Can't be good. Uh-huh. Ah, and apparently I can holster my weapon. Okay, and if I do that, some people don't kill me. I didn't know that. I, I apparently didn't have to kill all these people in that room, if you remember, from last time. <laughs> and the flashlight is apparently something I'm not supposed to use very often at all either, which is concerning. But oh I guess, guess it makes sense. Oh no, the Flugschreiber! Oops. <laughs> God damn. No. <laughs> that I'm fehlerhaft. Data corrupted. Okay. Okay. Yeah, that will help. <laughs> Not. Konzentrier dich. Uh oh. Uh, uh. What's gonna happen if I don't, you know, do stuff in time? I don't even know. Okay, what now? Nothing? Is this it? Am I gonna die now? For seconds. Here now, can't I? Yep. All right then. Ah, there we go. Easy peasy, lemon squeezy, so breezy, whatever. Uh, okay. Six and tomorrow together. Androids and, and creepy shit. I hate when they're cupboards. Because that means I can hide. What? Oh, it's full. Okay, everything's full. Blue security card, very good. Ruhrist an Marshal Waits. Hier spricht Chief Porter von Tech Support. Waits, da ist nichts auf dem Flugschreiber. Wir haben weiß Gott wie viele Firmendatenschutzrichtlinien gebrochen und können nichts vorweisen. Nichts 
außerdem Wayland Yutani Logo und einer leeren Auslesung. Diese Teile wurden für die Ewigkeit gebaut, also hat entweder jemand auf äh, der Nostromo den Mutterprozessor beauftragt, ihn zu formatieren, oder die Daten waren beschädigt, bevor sie hier ankamen. Kann mir vielleicht jemand erklären, warum das eine Priorität war? Hm. Someone sabotaged the data. That's not good. It's not good at all. I don't even know what's what's really happening right now. Maybe I should save the game. It's always good. What's that noise? Activate the security lock. <laughs> Great. <coughs> mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Mm. You gotta build some stuff to get rid of, you know. Do I have a map or something again? Uh, hack the lift to get to seeks and communications. Um, yeah, but first I gotta deactivate the locks. However, I'm gonna do that. Beware of back theft. Uh huh. I don't. Th <laughs> I think that's like the least of my worries at the moment. This is gonna get really stressful once the alien is here, I can just tell, I, I just know. <laughs> it's gonna be horrible. Just horrible. Terminals. Sevasto Link. Antwort, Sevastopol Terminals. Chief, die gute Nachricht ist, dass die Archivierung des internen Mailsystems von Sevastopol im Zuge der Stilllegung zu 80% erledigt ist. Die Verbindung zu Apollo wurde getrennt, aber das einfache Nachrichtensystem funktioniert noch für die Leute, die noch hier sind. Die schlechte Nachricht, wer auch immer das System erstellt hat, hat bei der Hardware gespart und es gab ein paar undichte Stellen. Mike Tanaka schaut sich die Sache an. Er ist der Spezialarchivar, den wir bestellt haben und er scheint sich auszukennen. Ich wollte sie nur schon mal warnen. Franco. Okay, so apparently the Ark Archivization, how do you say that, of the mail system of the Vastopol um, is done 80%. Uh, the connection to Apollo was uh, cut, but a simple messaging systems still work for the people who are still here. The bad uh, news is that whoever created the system saved money when buying hardware, and there are some leaks. And Mike Tanaka is going to have a look at that. What's that? Ein Vorposten des Fortschritts? Trostlose Isolation. Die Raumstation, die niemand wollte, verwaltet von einer Firma, die wir alle vergessen haben. Sevastopol ist nur noch ein rückständiges Nest. Die Bevölkerung liegt bei einem Zehntel der Optimalzahl. Andock Rampen stehen leer und die Rolläden der Geschäfte und es sind allesamt runtergelassen. Bestellungen für Sexon kostensparend hergestellte Androiden sind längst Schnee von gestern und das antiquierte Apollo-KI-System unterliegt häufigen Störungen. Wie konnte es soweit kommen und viel wichtiger noch, wohin sind die Milliarden von Dollar an Investitionen verschwunden? Mein Name ist Julia Jones. Für diesen Bericht in der Colonial Times habe ich zwei Monate lang auf der Sevastopol gelebt und den Preis entdeckt, den unsere zweitrangigen Firmen für ihre Überexpansion im Wettrennen in der Tiefe des Weltalls zahlen müssen. Um, some journalist that lived at, on board the station is kind of 
revealing what's happening or they, they she says she knows what's happening to the station um what the price is that everyone has to pay blah 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 um, okay what else do we have here eh okay like this audio no audio okay anyway i think i missed one yeah uh, Oh, nothing in there either. Oops, okay. Good then. Hmm. Really need a station to build stuff. Or can I just craft stuff any time? I think I can, actually. Uh, how did you do that again? Do, 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 do. I forgot. <laughs> well, that's not good. If I forget how to craft stuff. Maybe... So I probably need one of those stations to do that. Ah, oh, there we go. It should do it. Or not. Oh no. That's not good. That's not good. <coughs> oh shit. That is probably the sequence my friend Sven was talking about. Why would it do that? Crap. <laughs> so now it begins. I hate this already. already. Let's see. Uh oh. It's in the vaults. The air vents, I mean. What? I don't like this. One bit. Am I even walking the right way? Looks like it. Is this the, the terminal I've just been at before? Yeah. Great. Ah! Uh. So 
I was told never to walk under some of those, but only when there's like saliva. I can't see anything, but I'm gonna be careful anyway. <laughs> uh. Uh, wait, no, I've been here before. What's going on here? No. Ah. So, how can I hack? Where, where's the, the thing to hack? <laughs> Damn it. And where's the damn alien? Well, maybe down here? Isn't... Oh, time is up. Guys, that means you're gonna have to wait until the next episode to find out if I make it out here alive or not. If you enjoyed the video and if you want more, leave a like and subscribe to the channel. And uh, apart from that, thank you very much for watching. Don't forget to get Germanized and here comes GX Plofist.